Oh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, hello there. I'm Djin. This is War of the Visions Final Fantasy Brave XVS. And I'm going to be pulling for this new vision card, Irresistible Darkness. This is Dwayne's card. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to do the step up. This is only on YouTube. This was not streamed. Um, so this is kind of like secret YouTube polls. Uh, but yeah, pretty much that is all. Uh, I'll probably have to go all the way. It's guaranteed at step five, but you never know. Maybe I won't. It is any kind of viz. It doesn't have to be paid viz, so thankfully I'm not going to have to crack into that paid. As you know, if you watched my previous polls and things, you saw my Dwayne. All right, this is poll numero uno. Now I did acquire... Ooh, that's a card, so this could be a, a first pull and done if that changes the rainbow. But uh, yeah, I did acquire my viz via Amazon coin, if you guys don't know what that is. Uh, if you play this game through the Amazon App Store, you can actually use Amazon Coin. Dang it, I was hoping that would change to Rainbow. You can use Amazon Coin to uh, buy Viz. Ooh, oh, come on. Ugh. There's a lot of MRs I need, and that's not one of them. <gasps> no. Ah, oh, Odin. Dude, come on. Ah, oh, I thought that could have been the one. But anyways, yeah, I'm sure you guys are tired of hearing about it, but they do sponsor uh, these videos and stuff, so. Um, but yeah, Amazon Coin, you do need to play through the Amazon App Store, but it saves you a good amount. Like, it will save you up to 20%. And it's, like, if you spend a lot, like some of us do, that adds up to a lot. Oh, a brown book this time. I, I don't have a hopes for an Odin. You know, so, the bad thing, uh... Ooh! Okay, uh, this isn't going to be a card though, so I guess that's not... I mean, there's still units that I need too, don't get me wrong. But anyways, Odin uh, is a, a card that I do need. I have been trying to build Odin. My Odin is not built at all, so getting dupes of Odin for me is very good. I've gotten a lot of dupes of Odin, so alright, come on, change. Oh. oh, another not one that I need. I don't think. Change. Dang it! Ah! Oh! All these old MRs. There's so many newer MRs that I need, but or want. Not not these launch MRs, man. Get these launch MRs out of here, eh? All right, but it's all good. It's all good. This is all part of the step up. Plus, we get the other stuff, the other bells and whistles that come along with these um, these steps and things. All right, here we go. Pull number three. Wait, wait, wait. So for that first one, wait, wait, wait. For that first one. We got Gill Snapper, second one was Eggs, and this one is Magicite. Okay. The next one, step four, is going to be Rainbow Spheres, and step five is the guaranteed card. I I can already feel me going all the way to step five, because I'm not lucky like that. that. Man, I see people like doing these pulls on streams and stuff all the time, and they're always getting the cards before... Come on, man! They're always getting the cards before... To... Oh, change. Ah. Oh. Alright, hopefully that yellow at the bottom is, uh, like, Shell or somebody. Oh, perfect! That's exactly one of the MRs that I want. I want her, I want Salir, um, I want Shell. And what other MRs are good that I want? I don't know. Oh, that was a card. I don't think I need any MR cards. I think I've got all the MR cards maxed. Uh... I don't actually, I don't know anything about that guy's unit, to be honest. I don't have him maxed, but uh, yeah, so I guess that one's alright. I don't know if he's any good, though. That is one unit that I've, like, seen nothing about. He's, if I had to guess, I'd say probably not anything super great, but you never know. I don't know. Could be a sleeper. Could be somebody cool to worth working on once we don't have to use rainbow fragments on uh, MR, so I don't know. This is pull. This is uh, number four. Come on. Okay, it's another uh, unit for the final. Ooh, I was hoping for a change. I could feel a change, but nope. I guess not. Ah, oh, this one's the worst one. Oh wait. Ah. Oh. Come on, baby. At least I got the Odin. I, there's been times where I do these five-step step-ups for a guaranteed card slash Esper and not got a single rainbow in any of the steps, except for the guarantee, and that's infuriating. And it's happened to me multiple times. Oh, okay, I'll take it. That's not bad. 
Um, but yeah, at least I got the Odin this time. I mean, there's a chance in this final step too, I could maybe get multiple rainbows, but it's probably not gonna happen at this point, judging by how this is going. Um, but at least I got the Odin. All right, this is it. The final step. The final step down. Oh, oh yeah, this is the guaranteed one. Dang it. I finally get a gold book and it's the guaranteed to be a gold book. This is in the final slot. Okay, some of these could change, but uh, I don't know. They're all cards too. Ugh, I have him maxed. I don't have that MR card, Max. Mm, I'm not sure. I think I have that one, Max. Ooh, okay. I'll take it. All right. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about that one either. Anyways, this is the guaranteed. So this is the irresistible darkness. This was the whole point of this video. This is what I was going for. I was hoping it wouldn't go until all the way until step five, but... Uh, but it did. So there's that. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty cool. I wanted to do something else like secret YouTube pull, but I don't know. I feel like I shouldn't. I got, you know, I got more viz though. I got more viz to burn. But it's just stupid if I just throw it at something, right? Like, I already did a pull on this banner on stream. I did a random YOLO pull on the Luartha banner. Should I do a YOLO Luartha pull right now? I mean, this is dumb, but... Eh, okay, let's do it. Let's do one. And then I'm not pulling for her at all. I'm not going for pity or anything. I'm just gonna do one pull on this banner. Maybe get lucky. Probably not, though. Uh, but I did get the Irresistible Darkness, so that's good. And, um... You know. Okay, Adelard's good. Adelard is definitely an MR that I would like to finish. He's... He's a good chunk of the way there, not there yet though. Damn. Oh, I mean, double Adelard at least. Maybe that even finishes them, I don't know. Let's We'll find out at the end of this when it tells me which things get converted to shards or whatever. Nope, so yeah, Adelard is not done. So that was alright, I guess. Um... Yeah, I haven't really had anything noteworthy in any of my free polls, except for the first one, which you can see in my previous Dwayne video. The polls in that video were insane. So it's it's only fitting that I didn't have, like, great luck on anything I did right here. Because the polls in my Dwayne session sitting... I know I didn't pull for Dwayne, but at the, the same video, you know, when I did all those polls. That stuff was really good. I feel like I had very good luck there. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I guess that is all. I got the card. Also, the, for some reason, it lets you do this step up many times. Like, I could do this again if I wanted to. Seems a little crazy, but I guess if you get desperate and you're trying to max this card out and you're, you know, the time is coming to an end, because it is limited. This is a limited card and it is basically made for Dwayne. Um, it's got attack up, magic resistance up. So it's, again, it's not like as good as Ifrit by himself, like the attack up by itself, not as good as Ifrit, the magic resistance by itself, not as good as Fenrir, but it's, the party ability alone is cool because it's both of them, you know, so it's, you get some offense and some defense, which in my opinion is really cool and very helpful. Sometimes, like, sometimes you have too much defense or too much offense and you want to balance it out a little bit more, at least in my opinion, like, I, I run into that sometimes where I'm like, man, I wish I wasn't just stacking on total defense here or total offense. So I actually really love this, these card abilities. Um, and then whoever else wears the card also gets slash up at attack, so that's cool. But if you use it on Dwayne himself, he also gets dark attack up 20. So Dwayne, Dwayne benefits greatly from this, but anyone else, it's still all right. It's like, you know, it's a balance card. It's not going to be total glass cannon attacker card, and it's not going to be total turtle defensive card, you know? It's kind of in the middle there. Um, and yeah, so it's got its uses. But for Dwayne, he's got that extra attack, so that could push it over the edge to being a very good card for 
uh, damage dealing for Dwayne. Anyways, that's pretty much all I got, so... Thanks for watching, and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Night, morning, afternoon, I don't know. I don't know. Any of those things. See ya. Bleh.